What's up YouTube? It's Joe Gas here and today I'm going to tell you how to download and load brushes and patterns into Photoshop CS4, CS3, or really any Photoshop. Um, so yeah. Also, before I start the video, I'd really like to make a shout out to iJordan0023. You gotta check him out guys. He makes iPod Touch videos, PSP vids, theme reviews for like um, iPod themes and stuff, hacks, tutorials, and way much more. So his link will be in the description. You really need to check him out. So what we're going to do is open up Safari and go on to BrushEasy.com. The link will be in the description and you don't need to have this as your source. You could simply Google search brushes, abstract brushes, whatever you're looking for. We're just going to click on the brushes tab. Um, let's see guys what we got here. A lot of awesome brushes. Let's try to go on next. Try to find something really cool. This looks very nice. We'll click on that and click preview, and when we preview it, it'll open up in a window of the splats we got. They look like paint splats or whatever, so we're going to download that. It's very, very fast to download. Now, some will be a folder like this one, and you'll just open that up, and when you open it up, it'll have the brush files in it, and others will just be the brush file itself, which is really more simpler. So I'll just drag that to my desktop and go onto the Patterns tab. Now they do have a lot of awesome patterns also. And don't forget guys, on the side here you could search for a category. We could look for some grunge patterns, filter that out. Um, uh, let's see what we got, vintage, no. They don't have too much patterns, you know what I'm saying? So I suggest you just do by category and just search that up because they really only have two pages of patterns you could just search it up online if you want I'm not gonna go that far with it so let's go find some good patterns um, the carbon fiber looks pretty nice preview that and it'll show you the pattern that's a nice pattern so download that too and wow that was fast Drag that to our desktop, clear that up, X out of here, and let's go on to Photoshop, guys. Um, so once we open up Photoshop, we're just going to load the brushes in. File, new, I'll make a 1000 by 1000. Go to our brush tool, and right here, when you select your brushes, I've loaded all these brushes on. Um, you're just going to want to click this little play button right here, and you're going to click load brushes. Now there will be some brushes that we downloaded, the splat brush. When we load that up, it should have all these splatters. Now I'm just going to go on the help tab and type in pattern. Um, Let's see. Oh, we click on that. I know there's a way to do it, guys, but whatever. Layer, new layer fill, pattern, okay. And just click on this and click the play button. Load patterns. And we're going to load the fiber carbon pattern. So once we've done that, it should pop up like that. I'm going to load that in. I'm going to go on my brushes. I'm gonna choose a paint splat, click there, okay, now we can do it. I'll choose a nice light blue color and splat that on there, like that. It looks very, very nice. Um, let's see what else we got. We have all this cool stuff, guys. It's one o'clock. Yeah, um, you know what I'm saying? Flat on the edge there. Make it look real nice.
You know what I'm saying, guys? I'll change the color here to a uh, yellow. Rotate that. So, yeah, guys. I made a really quick design that fast in Photoshop just by downloading some nice brushes and patterns. Well, thanks for downloading, and once you're done, I'm not downloading, I'm sorry, guys. Thanks for watching this video, and once you're done, you can delete the brushes since they're already loaded into Photoshop. So, thanks for watching this video. Please comment, rate, and subscribe, and re please don't forget to check out um, Jordan's channel. He has some nice videos and really deserves some more subscribers. So, thanks, guys, and have a nice day.